Now to another bizarre twist in the case of that Illinois police lieutenant who staged his own suicide. Investigators now say he considered hiring a hitman to take out the woman who may have exposed his illegal activity. ABC's Alex Perez has the story. This morning, new details on Lieutenant Joe Glinowitz's plan to cover up his tracks. Investigators say that in addition to embezzling tens of thousands of dollars from a police department youth program he directed, text messages showed the officer, nicknamed G.I. Joe, even considered killing village administrator Ann Marin. He wanted to speak to this high-ranking motorcycle gang member to initiate a hit on the village manager. Police say Marin had ordered an audit of his program demanding a full report of its finances. It's a very scary thought that an officer who is sworn to uphold the law would even attempt to think to do something like that. Authorities say fearing he would be exposed, Glenowitz killed himself with his own gun in September, shooting himself twice in an elaborate plan to make it seem like he had been gunned down in the line of duty. At the time, many here embracing his family while police searched for suspects that they now say never existed. For two months, his widow insisting he would never take his own life. There were things that were happening in our life that people who are going to commit suicide would never do. But according to ABC affiliate WLS, authorities are now investigating the lieutenant's widow and son in connection with his embezzlement scheme. And an investigator tells me he can neither confirm nor deny whether the lieutenant's family is now part of the criminal investigation. In a statement through their attorney, the family has only said they have been cooperating with the investigation. Robin, thank you, Alex.